Yeah, the number killed increasing rapidly uh, and from the pictures uh, and the information that we're beginning to gather from the scene, it was clearly a very, very difficult rescue operation. You can see from some of the pictures here just how many uh, uh, fire engines were attending the scene. It's a uh, poultry factory in Jinlin province, Jilin province uh, to the northeast of China, northeast of Beijing. Uh, and uh, from what we can gather, uh, it was, as I say, very, very difficult, a complicated interior structure, we're told, to this factory, the poultry factory, uh, which uh, made it that much more difficult for people to escape. Uh, when it's uh, fully operating, 3,000 people work inside the factory, although we know that only 300 uh, were in there at the time of the fire, which appear to have started in the early hours of this morning. And as I said, difficult for people to escape, and there are also suggestions uh, that the gate, the front gate the factory was locked at the time. Now that, of course, made it even more difficult for people to get out. There will, of course, be questions uh, for the authorities. Uh, industrial accidents are very, very common in, in, in China. You hear a lot of accidents in uh, tin mines, coal mines, uh, and in other places as well. So I think there will be questions for the government. They say they're trying to crack down uh, on, on this sort of thing and make sure that it doesn't happen. But you can be sure uh, that the local authorities certainly will be questioned hard about why this happened at the moment. Uh, the police are not giving very many details about the cause at all.